Tech Application. This video is going to be my setup guide on a router, a D-Link router, and for this one I'm going to be using the DIR601. So the first thing you'll need is the power cable that came with your router. So I'm just going to go ahead and take it off. And then you want to plug it in to your power bar. And then you can take the other end and route it up. I'm just doing this really, really quickly. I, have, I would advise that you do it more neatly. But essentially what you do is you take it and you plug it into the power port on your router. Like that, and it will start to boot up. So while that's doing that, I'm gonna turn on the PC so that it's ready to go. So now that that's all ready, then you need internet. So the second thing you need is the internet cable. Actually. I'm pretty sure you start with the begin here. So let us do that. So I'm just going to take out the CD and put it into the CD drive. So now it'll come up with this dialog box. So you just want to hit run. And then when it asks, and then you want to, there's your router, or my router. So you want to hit English. And you want to just hit install router, you agree, because otherwise it won't let you, hit yes. You have to be the administrator, just run this, just to let you know. So select your language, I speak English. Checking network adapter. So your computer has to be connected to the internet in order to um, do this. Hopefully the router doesn't need to be, um, plugged in in order to do this. So I will come back when this is... Oh, there we go. Enter the username and password for your existing router. So, uh, that's good. I think that's it. I don't know if it's talking about the router that we're trying to set up, or... I want to connect my new router to my existing router and use them both. So you you can select um, which one you want. So just let's get started. Remove the sticker covering the back of your new D-Link router. I did that in my unboxing. Plug in the Ethernet cable, which came with the router. So on the back, there's an, one Ethernet port. So what you want to do is you want to take the cable that came with it plug it into the ethernet port then plug the other end into the ethernet port on your modem mine has four of them but if you just if yours just has one, that works as well. So just like that. You know that there's an Ethernet connect, or you know that your router has an internet connection if there's a, a globe that's on and the light means that there's Wi-Fi. So let's go back to the computer. So 
So after you've done that, you can hit next. Now it says plug in the included power supply, which we already did. And it's just waiting for the router. Hold on a second. So unfortunately I missed where you enter in your password for your router and your uh, network name, but um, when it asks for your SSID, that's your network name, and for your security key, that's what you have to enter every single time that you log into your router. And the password is when you try and access the uh, tools on your router. And there's a little space where the CD was to uh, do that. So it's just it's uh, just finishing up. And I think that concludes this video, guys. Um, don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe. And if you have any questions, post them up down below. Questions or concerns. So, thanks for watching, guys.